Hey baseball fans, I am just for MLB Baseball Blogs and free agent pitcher Luis Ayala, former with the New York Yankees, has decided between two teams. He's currently a free agent right now and the Yankees who last week are now saying we are interested in bringing him back, uh, but going on through this week, they have decided, you know what, we can work without Luis Ayala. We're probably going to try to disappear from uh, re-signing talks from him so he, the Yankees are most likely not going to try to re-sign him and try to bring him back not even under a minor league contract but he has decided between two teams where he would like to sign and these two teams have interest in him and those two teams are one team being AL East fellow the Baltimore Orioles who really need some uh, help in that bullpen somewhat and you also have AL West one of my favorite teams the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim yes I am an Angels and a Yankees fan if you guys look in the past videos, you guys will understand where I'm coming from for being an Angels and Yankees fan. I said it over a thousand times, but my insight on this, I think if Ayala wants to remain in the major league or he wants to start off working in the majors and working his way up, getting his uh, fastball up, getting his getting better uh, mechanics and his pitching, um, I think if he really wants to stay in the majors, I think the best shot of him staying in the majors has got to be with the Baltimore Orioles because... The Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim have a lot of set players in that bullpen right now. I mean, he's going to have to compete for somebody if he really wants this that bad. He has to go through guys like Hisanori Takahashi. He has that role set up. Um, Jerome Williams is coming is possibly going to be in that starting rotation, or he's going to be in the bullpen because Brad Mills is in there. He could possibly be a number four or a number five. Um, you got Latroy Hawkins who just signed. I know that these are not big names. These are very older type of pitchers but these guys have the experience and they're most likely going to be having that that bullpen role you got Trevor Ball you got Scott Downs Kevin Jeps I mean it's just going to be a hard time for Luis Ayala to compete with these guys but if you're going to the Baltimore Orioles you're going to have a better shot you're going to it's going to be an easier competition I should say but I think if Luis Ayala is going to have a shot in making the majors it's going to have to be the Baltimore Orioles I want to hear your guys' insight on this one check out the Facebook page check out the YouTube channel subscribe and check out the website I have a blog on this right now so I want to hear your guys' comments on the website I want to hear some good comments guys all bad comments will be taken down and I want to know where will Luis Ayala go in your guys' opinion. I'm Justin for MLB Baseball Blogs. I'll see you guys later.